Meow. Meow. Hi, it's Penny Bowden here, crazy cat artist. And I could not resist this cute little sleepy kitten showing off toe beans. So we're just getting the general shapes in now. And the kitty sleeping under a pink blanket. Isn't that just fitting with pink toe beans? Good stage for corrections for sure. This is where you want to work out all the bugs. Look at how that cute little muzzle just appears. Kind of overdid the nose there. I'm going to fix that up. Your eraser is just as useful a tool as your pencil. So don't be afraid to use it. If we always got it perfect the first time, there'd be no challenge in it, would there? It'd just be like rote practice. Just going to get some toe beans in there. The toe beans are start sort of part of the star of the show here. And this one's turned sideways a little bit. Smock away until it looks right and comfortable. I sure did here with this cute little face. Because I want it to look just right. Not perfect, but just right with the expression. And it's this expression that, that this kitten has that is such a charming part of what I want to draw here. And it needed to be up a bit higher. Those floppy ears. I guess they're kind of getting squished by the fact that the kitten's laying on its back and the ears are kind of squashed against the bed or whatever. I like how one eye sort of looks a tad bit open. Lazy eyelid. I love to hear from you, so please do drop me a comment about yourself or your cat or tell me what you want to learn about cat drawing. And if you do that, please put video idea in capital letters and then and then you can tell me your idea and I'll do my best. Speeding up here, finish up. Darken some spots up to help them stand out a little to get some interest into the drawing. It's good to vary your lines in intensity and in thickness and, and whatever. However you can vary things, it keeps the interest in the drawing. I'm liking it. Add some whiskers pretty quick here. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.